in wide. Goodness me, she took it. Of court did Cheng Shu. Twenty game point. Yeah. Nineteen. I think she'd broken the frame of the racket. Yeah, indeed. Just ask our opponents if she can test the new racket. Courtesy amongst the players, not a requirement under the rules. That does mean that four straight points from the Olympic champions takes them to game point in this opening game. Saved. Courageous play. It's 20 all. That's over. 20 all. There's going to be two points in it. And therefore we'll continue to play until that two point advantage is achieved. Turn of serve from Du Jing. 21-20. And having saved a game point, now they have a game point of their own. <laughs> What's landed in? Game. Du Jing was so convinced that it was going to go wide, she was already celebrating. What a misjudgment. First game won by Shen Zhu, Zhao, Yung Lai, 22-20. So, surviving a game points. Ghastly error there from Du Jing. And the number three seeds, Cheng Shu and Zhao Yung Lai. And the opening game in 24 minutes. 22-20. That even just shows what a balanced pair they are. Both can go forward to the net, both strong at the back. We always think of Yu Yang as the player that prefers to go forward because of her mixed doubles. But it does just show that Du Jing, within that partnership, equally as competent at the front. Whereas, I think the other pair, that proves the fact that Zhao Yun Lei, she is the one who's just won more than the title in the mixed doubles. She's the one that prefers to go to the front. One thing I really didn't notice in that opening game, Ian, was the fact that this pair, Cheng Shu and Zhao Yunlei, do have a very much favoured formation with the taller Cheng Shu at the game. back of the court thundering down the smashes and Zhao oh. Yunlei. We know she's brilliant at the net because that's what she did so well in the mixed doubles final, winning that title. But that's very much how they want to play. Whereas I think the, the Olympic champions are far more willing to have a rotational formation, either one going to the front and either one going to the back. Service over, one. Yes, up. I think that's a very good point. Du and you now are a very complete pair. They can both play four court. They're both very strong in defense and uh, very, very difficult to break down. What 
what I would say about the other pair is that Zao is a very, very aggressive four-court player. And I think this is where the tactics will be interested in the second set to see how doing you try and keep her away from the net. I think this will be, these will be the tactics to follow, whether they'll be lifting out a little bit more to her and trying to bring Cheng into the net. We'll just see how it goes. great confidence after a great performance Two, in the mixed final one. earlier on. Everything she's trying at the moment is coming off. Unlucky, but there's you. That's seven, proof of your point, Jill. Two, Zhao again moving into the front of the court and setting it up, but unfortunately a partner making the mistake. to the back Two. that's when this <coughs> championship silver medalist pair do look a little more vulnerable yes there we saw she was already trying to move forward and then just caught with the shot over her head which forced the mistake Interesting there, Ian. I thought that uh, Zhao Yunlei came so far back. Look at her, her movement off the shuttle. She's almost at the mid-court area, even though she's what we call the net player, because she's coming back and that movement, we talked about it in the mixed doubles. It really is very, very good. Yeah, she's very, very active when, when, a, when it's a par Four. her partner that's taken the shuttle. She's always moving, never never in a static position and there she's just drifting off anticipating the drive return but very very well placed to move in if, if there is a chance close to the net oh, it's gone well wide yeah i know that she is a very very fit athlete but Come back to the point, Ian, that 12 matches in six days is a lot. And remember, of course, that she was playing last week. She played the German Open, reached the final. She's had an awful lot of badminton in the last...